Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2 History Lords in the Dramat. Now, this area... It scares me a lot, you know? For relatively obvious reasons, I imagine. So not all of the statues come to life. That's good, you know, but there's still a matter of requiring the symbol of the king for various tasks. Alright, so some of these guys also come to life. Like the one in this corner. Oh, hello. I thought I killed all of you. Well, clearly the only thing I can do right now is hide in the bonfire room while drinking a potion. Back over here. Could have used smaller ones. So, do you guys just Wait everywhere for these sort of situations. Ah, uh, I was standing too close to the door. That's what happened. Yeah. I don't need that stamina. I need to drink up because this was awfully close. Pop a life gem as well. Whew. I like this area a lot. It's relatively terrifying. Neither of you? Neither of them. Huh. So obvious it's a more clever sort of trap. I'm at the dodge stand. For obvious reasons. Such as not having a lot of health left. Hello? It's you! From armor set. Huh. There's another bonfire down here, so... That sounds like a sign of going in a direction. Though not the town convinced it's the right direction, you know? Oh, hello, you again. Young undead, don't let this curse weigh upon you. We meet a second time. Perhaps you will yet traverse the dark. 
I need a lot more intelligence and faith for that. If you truly seek the dark, then we will surely meet again. I know where his last point is. But no, I don't have the ability to actually put that to any sort of use. But this ta this bonfire here allows us to come back to him anytime we want now. So this is that. Now of course we are encountering a small bit of trouble in regards of this room. Because this guy will go back to... Oh! Because these doors are still open. And probably because the small guys will come back to life. Right? Yep. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. God damn it, I shouldn't have risked that. Oh, still with a sliver of health though, but I should have had him try and get behind me. This area is just dreadful. Alright, well. Fucked up again. Get past me, you sword. How do you keep hitting me without hitting the wall? That's not. That's kind of overpowered, dude. You know, fast though, I don't know if this is actually where I'm supposed to be at. And it looks like me not knowing what I'm supposed to be doing. Affects my adventure quite a fair bit. At that time, they should get blocking. I knew it was a two strike attack. For fuck's sake. There we go. Again. Alright, can I get to the other wall now? And investigate what lies in these chambers. Apparently additional enemies. That's what. Hello? Hello? Um... Does he know not yet count as an answer? Please, lady, if you would follow me into the, my chambers, I would very much like to entertain you right here. Thank you. Well, I should have kept blocking. Ugh. We got lucky this time. The second swing did not hit me while I was doing my stupid things. So was he saying that the entire side door there was pointless or just that particular door? Okay.
There we go. Okay, this looks safe enough. To be fair, had it been a trap, I would have been so mad. Uh. The flipping swords. No, I don't want to fight you. You're big and you're mean and you're... Not very fun to fight. Come on. Like, who thinks it's a good idea to put five enemies that used to be boss mobs into the same area? Assume there's five. There is five. Hi. That was very unwise of me. I'm like a smithy, I'm a bloody anvil. Just, just kept hammering me there. Hoping there's no trap, there's no trap. Okay, cool. Royal Soldier Ring plus one. Ooh, what does that do? Gives us even more of a boost. Awesome. Taking that. And then I'll have a drink. Wait, I should... I'm gonna have to assume... That there's a way to also feed these things, but I don't know if there's an advantage to it. What will you do when you hold out your torch? You simply light the area. Okay, and you? Probably also simply light the area. That's, prob that's probably gonna simply going to be amazing. Without any additional advantages to it. And you, you just die. No, it was this guy that came back to life, right? Back to life is an exaggeration. Surely. Anyway, this looks like the right way, then, I guess. Yeah, you wanna go? Mate? Right, the mate did not have an interesting going. And this is a real chest. With dark arrows. There's a frozen flower. Right, you wanna go, okay? Okay, okay. You're not too bad, luckily. Okay, so th some of these statues are rather odd. Of course, what's scaring me the most is the fact that some of those are actually statues and will not come to life to kill me. But let's be fair, probably most of them will. Maybe not. But no one was 
activate downstairs. What the hell is he doing? Anyone of you want to fight? Huh? Can we activate this somehow? Alright, well, I lost interest in that direction for now. Who could have imagined? Seriously, neither of you are coming to life. Cool, cool. Try fleeing. Um. Is this an evil chest? No. It's just a room that was really evil. And luckily for me, I was standing right in the right, correct spot to not be shot. Oh! Never mind. Chamber just remained permanently active now. Okay. Let's see if we can use these to live long and prosper uh, live long yes I don't really know about prosper right who wants to go everyone wants to go That was a bit more challenging than I would have liked. And that, that's you, I thought I had a master done. That would have been extremely fun in this situation, wouldn't it? Yeah. Bit of a dragon bone, oh yes. Torch, oh yeah. This means I get to burn their family mansions after this. Which I will want to do because they are assholes. Though I guess that would make me even a greater asshole. But you know, I'm allowed to be great. Nameless Usurper. Alright, show me what you got. Quite a fair bit of skill, that's what you've got. Okay, I'm gonna leave. You come here, you fight. Like someone who knows how to fight, okay? There we go, we made it banished. Woo. We didn't need any dark spirits here anyway, we were already having a lot of trouble. Well, crossbow, fellow. Oh, you're alive now. Can't say I'm a fan of that. Not really. Ooh, shite! Where did you get that from? I didn't know you were using performance enhancing ma magics. I know that. I'm looking. Far more prepared for this. Run a swordsman gloves. You two are just, you know, chilling, right? Yep. I was about to do an arc spin, but then I realized I was surrounded by walls on both sides, so that would probably have hurt me 
more than it would have hurt him. Yep. And hello, I. I'm not quite sure what I ex really expected here. You have fought admirably on your journey, cursed undead. I am Nishandra, Queen of Dranglik. A true monarch carries the weight of their souls. The last king of this land, King Vendrick, as he was called. He found the strength to rule his people, and when the undead were born, cursed. He found more strength to face them. But in the end, he never took the true throne. Visit Vendrick. We have no need for two rulers. Huh. Well, I was just quite expecting this. Oh joy. You know what this means? Yeah. A boss fight. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. You're the only one waking up then? Okay, cool. Back to sleep you go.